All right, guys, welcome to it. We are rolling out recipes, and on the menu today, it's all about the kiddies. That's right. This is a unique time, guys. Um, I want to just probably just raise a glass to parents and just to say kudos to you guys because I know it's not easy for parents. Homeschooling is an entirely new norm that I think I know you are getting accustomed to as things go along. So I'm here for you. I am here for you. Cup of Joe here for you. I am going to be rolling out recipes over the next few weeks just to show you how easy it is because they're not packing those lunch bags and those lunch kits and sending off the kids. They're right there. Mommy, Daddy, I'm hungry. <laughs> so we're looking at some kid-friendly meals that's going to be really easy for you to just to pull together and have when they're taking their little breaks and recess and that kind of thing. My first dish, very, very simple, shrimp. So it's all about crunchy and crispy. That's the theme. Crunchy and crispy. Today, with this shrimp, I am doing a crispy shrimp with honey glaze, with a beautiful honey glaze that will all come together. Perfect snack for those kids. First thing I'm gonna do, I seasoned up my shrimp, salt, pepper, very, very basic seasoning, guys. Nothing, nothing hard in here. But I just left the lime for last. I just want a little bit of lime just before I start working these shrimp. I just wanna mix that together very, very easily, very quickly. Um, and then, with my dry hand, I wanna salt and pepper just for a little extra layer of seasoning and I have a paprika that I'm gonna whip in my breadcrumbs. I already put salt and pepper into my flour mixture, so I really just wanted to season up my breadcrumbs for that little extra flavor. And let's get cracking. Full bread station. We have now our shrimp that we take with one hand, toss it in the flour mixture. This is a full breading station. Into the egg wash. Make sure it's fully coated with the egg wash and it dumps into the breadcrumb mixture. I'm using panko breadcrumbs. You can use any breadcrumbs you have, guys. Um, panko really gives it a little extra crispy and crunchiness. And there you go. Very, very simple. So it's a, a wet and a dry hand. Flour, coat properly. Dust off any extra into the egg mixture. Toss and coat into the egg mixture so that everything adheres when you toss it into your breadcrumb mixture. And I fry these up, it literally takes no more than two to three minutes and these shrimp are ready to go. Crispy, crunchy snack. And this really is the most time consuming thing for this dish. But once you have, once you organize yourself and you get your bread station, your breading station all organized, it really is simple, really, really is simple. Gonna get my oil nice and hot. While the oil is getting hot, I'm going to pull together a honey glaze. So when we fry these shrimp up, a lovely honey glaze will just simply glaze all over it. You're going to get a nice little sweet and salty type of flavor coming through. So I have about a third cup. So I'm using herb white honey, guys. Herb white honey is, is, my, is my honey of choice. Um, I love to support the local artisans and, and herb white is the honey straight out of all these wonderful areas that they create these beehives and make this local honey. And I have about a third cup of honey that I am getting in here. This honey glaze, too simple to be true. I am just really just taking a little salt, a little pepper, a little paprika, and then I'm kicking it up with some ginger. So I say about a half teaspoon of ginger. I have some pepper flakes. It's just gonna be a little kick. Nothing too heavy. And then I have some shadow benny that I have chopped up here. And I'm just gonna take that and mix it all together in the honey. Looking at it, I just have a little lime juice just for a little freshness. You don't want too much lime juice. You wanna maintain the lovely thick consistency of the honey. Time to fry those shrimp. In my oil, now you can deep fry this as well, guys, but I'm doing a kind of shallow fry these shrimp will not take long so just about a minute here and then about two to three minutes in all you turn and these shrimp are ready to rock and roll so when you turn just after about a minute look how lovely that looks guys another couple minutes and this will be ready so guys at this stage 
when the shrimp rather is, is nice and hot, this is kind of when you want to apply the honey glaze. So I'm going to plate up right away. So you take the shrimp and you pile it up nicely. If you don't have jumbo shrimp, hey, don't be afraid guys. You can use any shrimp that you have in your refrigerator. It's really, really simple. And at this stage when the shrimp is nice and hot, you really just want to take a nice drizzle of your honey glaze. This adds another wonderful layer of flavor and you just kind of just sprinkle it all over, drizzle it all over there. Find a little finish. Yeah, bam, bam. Shrimp is served. That's right. Full snack up, much more to come. We have a more crunchy and crispy to come. Kid friendly meals right here at Home Sweet Home.